Yeah, it's that time again for the Loser's Laments from week 11, your tales of woe, your trials, your tribulations, all of your sad stories from week 11 because we all took brutal losses on Monday night, especially this is Fantasy Football Bad Beats. The worst of the bad beats this week comes from Nick Griffin. I feel like everybody lost on Monday night. It can't have worked out that way. Somebody must have won on Monday night, but it wasn't me, and it wasn't Nick Griffin. He says, my QB throwing a TD actually lost me the game. Huh? He had Derek Carr. His opponent had Amari Cooper. God, I hate fantasy sometimes, he says. Um, I'm kind of feeling the same way this week. I lost, like, four matchups on Monday night. Poor Nick lost on a play that should have been productive for his team. I want to give you props for actually owning Derek Carr in the league where you named your team after Derek Carr. That is a major faux pas that many people commit. You, sir, have done it correctly. Um, maybe try downloading the Yahoo Fantasy app. How about that? Especially if you're going to send in screenshots to us. Um, but I hear you. This is a brutal beat. Um, this is bad. Facing your quarterback's uh, elite receiver is always going to be a problem. I feel for you. It's a weird game on Monday night. We're all uh, lesser football fans for having experienced it. This week's dishonorable mention, and oh, I have a share of this as well. It's from Juan Reyes. Uh, Juan writes, Novak couldn't attempt just one field goal in the fourth quarter. Oh, tell me about it. There's 6.18 left in the game. It's a tie. Uh, they have a chip shot field goal available to them, and instead they go for it on fourth and one. They don't make it. Really curious late game play calling from Houston. Cost me a win. Cost poor Juan a win. I hear you, buddy. Okay, those of you who actually survived week 11 and are moving on, uh, about half of you are going to take brutal beatdowns in week 12. When you do, send us the story. Remember, hashtag FFL Bad Beats.